Okay everybody, here we are. We're going to be checking out this guy, which I just got in the mail today, the new Sigma 50mm f1.4. It's obviously Sigma's new art lens. The pricing was just announced, um, let's see, today actually, the early, early this morning. Uh, priced at $9.49. The Canon mount, which is this one, will be going, uh, coming out first. It will be start shipping on the 25th of April, I believe. So uh, let's go ahead and check this out and open it up and uh, see what it looks like. So it comes in this box. It's, you know, pretty standard Sigma Fair for their newer lenses. Um, your usual, uh, you know, your manual and your uh, warranty sticker and all that fun stuff. And then it's straight down to business. Not a whole lot of extra crap. You got here your, um, your carrying case for keeping it safe when you're uh, out and about. Open it up here, and inside we have the brand new Sigma 50mm f1.4. This thing is a beauty. It's actually not nearly as heavy as people make it out to be. Um, the Sigma 24-105, which I am recording this video on right now, is actually quite a bit heavier than this lens, at least it feels like it to me anyway. So, um, yeah, the buttons on this are really smooth, nice, you know, they feel good. The, the zoom ring is smooth and not tight. Very nice. Front element here, looking good. Yeah, standard new Sigma, you know, global vision styling looks good. Of course, it has the A on the side here for art. And uh, yeah, so that's the, out in the, you know, the exterior of this lens. Obviously, of course, it also comes with the lens hood here for those of you who are into that sort of thing there's the lens hood now i'm going to be reviewing this guy here over the weekend i have it for five days and i'm going to be reviewing it and we're going to be taking it out i'm going to test it up against the old sigma 50 millimeter f1.4 and as well as the canon 50 millimeter f1.2 so go ahead and check out the sample shots I just threw up online uh, with this video. Um, I, you know, just took my son out right after getting the lens, and uh, he's obviously not the best model, so getting sh super, super sharp focus on, uh, on him at f1.4 is not an easy task, but uh, the lens performed really well. I'm really, really impressed with what I'm seeing so far after having it for, you know, just a couple hours now. So uh, let's go ahead and check it out a little bit more. And uh, you can read up more on the full written review at slrlounge.com. Thanks for checking this out, guys, and I'll talk to you later.